Hi everybody, welcome back to Pink K-Pop Academy. Today we are doing review four, which is gonna focus mainly on the waves and spins that we've been learning over the last couple of days, as well as some chest and hips and um, a little bit of footwork, a little bit of armor, all that stuff we've been doing, okay? This video is part of the 30 day beginner program, but you don't need to be doing this program um, to, to take this video, okay? You can just use it as a review for yourself, but if you're interested in the 30 day program, there's more information in the description box, okay? So just like all the other review videos, I'm gonna go through a couple of different moves that we're gonna put to music at the end. Today's music is Wannabe by Itzy. So, um, it's just got a really good beat that helps with the waves. It's, it's, you guys are going to feel it. It's real nice. So we're going to go through the moves first and then we'll get the music and then you guys will do it with the music, um, another kind of two or three times. And, um, then if you're doing the program, you might uh, replace your warm up with this and you keep doing this one or two times per day after this as well. Okay. But for now, let's get started with the move. So we're starting with a, a shoulder isolation like we did in the last review as well. Okay. But we're not, we're not going to do the big chest leans. We're just going to do the, the shoulder version okay so let's just go over that really quickly so starting with the right we're going right shoulder shoulders back chest up left shoulder and down back the other way left shoulder chest up right shoulder and down and we'll do that a couple of times and then we'll roll it around from side to side okay then we're going to do our hips so we're going boom to the right back left forward side, back, side, forward, and then it'll become a roll, which we will do and go back. So we're always going back the other way as well to make sure we get both sides, okay? Some nice hip circles there. And then we're gonna pop the arms out and we're gonna do the shoulders and the hips together. So we're going side, back, side, forward, side, back, side, forward, and then we roll it all together just like we did before okay so after we do these we're going to go into a cross step spin and this i've picked this one because this is the hardest spin i think all the other spins you guys can practice pretty well on your own but i wanted just to spend some time on the cross spin so you're going to step your right foot across first heel is going to touch the ground okay we're going to step that over lift up on your toes and turn to the back then you swap the heel and the toe and you turn to the front. So now your legs are crossed. Lift that heel and toe again. So left foot is, left toe is lifted, right heel is lifted. And we face the back. Swap it. So left heel, right toe, back to the front. We're going to do that again. So right toe, left heel to the back. Swap it. Right heel, left toe to the front. Lift those up again. Left heel, left toe, right heel to the back, swap it, right toe, left heel to the front. Okay, so we're going to do those slowly at first. It'll be one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Then we're going to speed it up. It's going to be one and two and, okay. And then instead of going back around, you're going to take the foot that's in front, in this case it's the left foot, and you're going to step it out and we're going to do a cross step. One, one, two, three, four. Now with this cross step, I want you to lean into the hips as you go, okay? One, two, three, four. We're going to make it a little bit sassy because we're doing wannabe here, okay? Then you're going to take the left foot and cross it over the right. Now we're going to spin again. Spin, lift, spin. Now the right foot's in front, off we go. One, two, three, four. Take the right foot. One and two and off we go. One, two, three, four. Cross the left foot over. One and two and right foot's in front. One, two, three, four. Now these might be tricky. This might take a couple of practices to get used to, but I'd really like you guys to get the hang of this because it's a really, really helpful way to show you how Spin, like spins are not standalone. They're never standalone. A spin instantly leads into another move, especially if the choreographer has used a heel toe spin, they've used it because it frees up the feet to move quickly again. So if that's why they've used it, we gotta practice it in that way. So it's okay if you get a little bit feet trippy at first and you can't quite get to the steps. Just keep trying it and keep practicing it and it'll come, okay? But I do feel like it's really important to get that feeling. So that's why I've put it in here as if it's kind of more like a real choreography. Okay, so after we've done that, then we're going into a 
body wave. So I'm going to face the front this time so because we're going to be facing the front with the music. So you guys can remember it. But we lift the chest up first, right? And then we bring the abs forward and then we bring the hips forward and then we drop it back. We want to go back up. We're going to bring the hips forward. Then we're going to lift up into the abs. We're going to lift up into the chest and we're going to let the head come forward. OK, so we're going to do a couple of those and back up. OK, and then we're going to do them full. We're going to keep them nice and slow at first and then we're going to speed them up. OK, and then we're going to shake all that off and we're going to do a heel toe. Yes, there is one of these in every single review, a heel toe, but a heel toe with a wave. So as you're pushing down with that foot, you're going to lift the chest up and wave down. Push, lift the chest up and wave down. Lift down, lift down. So we're not waving back up, we're only waving down for this one. Lift down. Use that push to force your chest up. Push down, push down, push down. Okay. The last thing we're going to do in this song is we're going to do a side wave. Okay. So plant the feet a little bit apart. You're going to push into the left hip first, then bring up the, the ribs, then bring up the shoulder and then bring up the head. And then we're going to just step into the other side. So push, lift, 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 and push, lift, 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 and push, lift, lift, lift. And then we'll make it flowy, but we'll keep it nice and slow because we're just getting the feeling of that lifting up. Make sure your head goes up last. Head goes up last. That's a really important part of making this move look really good is that the head goes up last. Last. If you have the head coming up as we go along, it loses the waviness. You let the head go last, it'll add a depth to it. Okay, so that's all the moves that we're going to do. So I'm going to go get the music now. And if you're not ready, if you need to practice those a little bit more, go back over them. Do them as many times as you need to before we get the music, okay? And then when you're ready, press play again and um, we'll dance together with the music. And I'll see you guys again afterwards, all right? Let's do it.
well done. All right, guys, well done. You finished review four. Now, if you're on the 30 day beginner program, this means all of your learning part is now finished. And what we're gonna be doing for the rest of the 30 days is um, learning different choreographies and practicing them and, and getting them better and better, okay? So, congratulations on finishing all of the basics for this section and on doing your review. So just like you did before, I'd like you to keep working on this review video. Again, today, do it two or three times. And then um, from tomorrow, keep it going one or two times, either add it to the other three if you're doing them all every day, or you can replace it with your warm up for um, for each day. OK, um, at least one or two times, please. All right. But then um, then you're just going to be working on the choreographies from now on. So you guys are awesome. You are amazing for doing all of this. You're amazing for everything that you have learned so far this month. Incredible. I'm so proud of you all. And um, I will see you all again tomorrow. Bye.